Yeah, I think again, it's a lot of what uh, maybe people said to me and maybe partly the confidence I got when I was at Harvard Business School. So my, as I mentioned, my dad was a, a company man. And so looking at him, the natural thing to do would have been go join a big company and stick with it for a while or, or at least stay in that universe for a long period of time. It would have been a good, it's, it's actually low risk in a sense. Right. My grandfather, on the other hand, was a hell of a risk taker. And, and that generation, anyway, had to deal with losing everything in uh, what is now Pakistan mm. and moving to India. And so, you know, there was a, a whole different element of risk in that uh, and, and dealing with adversity and stuff, which I heard about uh, when I was younger. And, and then, you know, my second job... Uh, after undergrad, but before business school, was at a private equity fund actually uh, called MDC. And the founder, George McCowan, had been to Stanford undergrad and Harvard Business School, 35 years older than me. Mm -hmm. But he took a real liking to me. I mean, I was a young guy at the firm. And it turned out that he was an Indophile. And it's interesting, you know, we made a three week trip to Asia. We were raising a new fund and we said, let's try to get some Asian investors. This was very early days. You know, mm -hmm. I joined them in late 93. And so this was in late 94 that we made this trip. And we spent a week in India and introduced him to a few people through my dad. And, you know, George ended up giving an interview to a couple of uh, magazines, Business India and, and, and one of the newspapers. And, and in that, he sort of casually mentioned, he never told me about it. That, hey, you know, we have this young bright star, Ashish, who works with me. And by the way, he's thinking about going to business school, but I can assure you that he's going to come back here someday and do what I've done in the US, which is set up a private equity fund. And, and if he ever chooses to do it, I'm there to support him. 